Hey guys, Richard here. So in this video, I want to talk to you about free traffic strategies. Now, this is a very, very important video for beginners because this is something that I know you're going to struggle with when you're first starting out online. Now, oh, first of all, as a beginner, I really want to make sure that you understand uh, the niche that you're actually going to be operating in when you start out your affiliate marketing business. What many, many people do, and I see this all the time, is they start to jump straight into a kind of a make money online niche where they're actually trying to sell goods or products or services to people to get them to learn how to make money online before you've ever really done that yourself. Now, it's not the great way to start. It's a very competitive niche and it's not a great way to start online. But if you have a niche that you're interested in, it might be pets, it might be uh, DIY, something like that, then you need to really understand what type of niche you're going to start off with and really concentrate on that niche when you're using any of these traffic strategies. Now, if you want to learn how to, how to understand how to build up an affiliate marketing business, I have got a free course. You'll see the link in the description below. Go ahead and go take that course. I think it's going to be a really, really important thing for you to do to get a good grounding on what affiliate marketing actually is so let's have a look at what these strategies actually are now the first one is social media now we all know about social media TikTok, facebook instagram all of these different types of social medias have got lots of people on them who may be interested in the same types of things as you are so they may be interested in the niche that you're going to concentrate on but there is some really, really important things you need to understand about social media. Social media is all about engagement. So it's all about talking to other people socially on that platform. So it's not the easiest kind of platform to sell on unless you start developing things like a Facebook group and get like-minded people together to start talking to them about the things that interest you. That's the most important thing on social media. Now there's lots of courses out there about how to build a business with social media, but what I want you to do is focus on one aspect maybe Instagram if you're looking at something that's very kind of tactile and you can take images of it Instagram would be a good one uh, Facebook if it's something is more general you want to start talking to people on Facebook pick one of them and really concentrate on building up an audience on that particular platform you might have a group yourself you might join other groups and start interacting with people try not to sell to them straight away there is lots of other tactics on social media about not putting affiliate links on social media which is counterintuitive which is basically what everyone teaches you to do just throw a link out there and hope someone actually clicks on it that doesn't actually work right what you need to be doing is bringing people off that platform onto your own blog onto maybe a landing page that you have and get them kind of um, into your own sphere of, of influence and then you can start selling things to them that's the key thing with social media next one up is blogging very specific blogging uh, very very uh, powerful if you start blogging and write, uh, creating articles about things that people are truly interested in really really powerful way that you can actually rank on google and also get people over that you're really interested in the same things as you are and you can get lots of valuable information to them and also put links in there to various other things like affiliate links that you can um, recommend products and services with really really useful uh, platform if you want to start a blog next thing is forums now you can go onto various forums there's literally thousands going to say millions probably is millions of forums out there that you can go ahead and utilize and they're full of people that again are interested in the same kind of things as you are but please do not go on there and start trying to sell straight away you need to go on there and actually impart a lot of your invaluable information there's lots of different ways you can get information to go on and actually give people real value before you actually say hey come over and look at my blog or whatever it may be or my youtube channel whatever it may be and only then can you get them into your sphere of influence and you can start trying to sell to them Next up is video marketing, something that I do. I go on YouTube, I have uh, videos on YouTube, and you can actually put videos on YouTube that are helping people, very similar to this one. And just giving bits of information to people who maybe are a little bit behind the curve and where you are in your journey, trying to make money online, and you can actually explain things to them. And also, if it's something like a very specific niche, you can give advice about how to do various things. Really, really powerful way to do it is on video, and it's you use things like YouTube. You get lots of free traffic on YouTube email marketing is something that you really build up over time so email marketing is something that once you're on somebody's list you can actually email them out to them and get traffic over to whatever it is you want to recommend so for again the, the rules around email marketing is 
provide value first give people information give people advice and then recommend things on the back end that you know will be valuable to them very important that you give value when you're doing things like email marketing first and then sell to them on the back end next we have search engine optimization so this is something that's very similar to kind of the blogging and um, when you use uh, develop a blog which is what our training will actually help you do one of the things that the training in, uh, in the description below will do is uh, give you advice on how to develop blogs how to develop YouTube marketing if you want to do that kind of thing um, it'll give you that type of advice but SEO is an important part of blogging how do you set up that blog in a certain way that you actually get your articles to rank and it means things like having a unique article having keywords in certain places making sure that Google recognizes your content as a valuable bit of content and then it will rank it and that's what SEO is all about and it allows you to get free traffic by ranking higher on things like Google and Bing influencer marketing is a slightly different one you might want to go on to places like TikTok and get one of the guys who are doing really well on TikTok to advertise your goods and services it's not strictly free right because you're gonna to have to give them a percentage um, you're gonna to have to give them some kind of reason to do that but essentially you're feeding off their traffic so it's not going to be as expensive as you trying to do it yourself you maybe can partner with an influencer who's going to recommend your products and services and help you out on those platforms and last one last but not least really is content marketing again it envelops all of these different types of things can you write articles can you publish videos can you answer questions on Quora can you do things on medium like write write little stories on medium and actually publish content that will drive people back to your own affiliate links and actually be able to make sales on the back end of producing that content it has to be valuable it has to be worthwhile but it's a really really good way for you to actually build up a really good way uh, of building your credibility and your knowledge so that people understand you're someone who can be trusted and somebody who can actually go ahead and recommend things to them that they will go ahead and buy so kind of a conclusion here there is some real uh, benefit to free traffic obviously if you go down the paid traffic route you have a very very um, specific way that you target people in, in 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 paid traffic and you can go ahead and utilize the tools on things like google ads or youtube ads to do that it is way more expensive it is much much faster i've got to give you that um, but it is way more expensive and it can be very very targeted if you do it correctly there is benefits of doing paid but when you're first starting out when you're a newbie you want to be going down the free traffic route and the real the reason for that is things like it is very cost effective you have the tools that you maybe need to use to to do a video on youtube but you can go ahead and do that reasonably cheaply and put a video on youtube for free and you'll start getting traffic you will get a targeted audience as long as you are concentrating on your niche and not trying to spread too thinly your audience will become more and more targeted they'll be interested in people like DIY if you do DIY videos or blogging and you will get a very targeted audience the long-term benefits are great because what it'll do is it'll actually um, you'll you because you're bringing people into your sphere of influence because you're actually bringing people to get to know you you'll end up having more and more people that trust you long term so you can actually make sales to people over and over again because they trust what you're going to say you're not going to try and rip them off you're actually going to give them real products that they can buy they're going to be useful to them again this ties in with this credibility thing the more advice I give you the more value I give you the more that uh, you know that I'm going to be trustworthy I'm not going to try and promote any old rubbish to you for instance if I'm an affiliate marketer you need to be able to build up a really really good uh, credibility if you use paid traffic they don't really know who you are because they've just clicked on an ad somewhere if you use free traffic they might come back more and more and more because they're seeing you and it becomes a little bit more organic and you can actually grow like that but you know it, it all depends how you actually treat that uh, traffic once it gets into your own sphere of influence um, and the next one is kind of greater control um, you can um, control when you actually publish your your blogs your videos all of that kind of great stuff and you can control uh, how often you do it and how much work you want to put into that to create that free traffic there is a caveat to all of this free traffic does take a while to actually go ahead and and start but once you get it i, I mean i get about i get about 500 people a day over to my youtube channel and i've got various other traffic sources so you do get a lot of people that come over and are interested in your goods and services and it actually is a really good way of developing a business very very inexpensively so guys that was just eight ways there are more ways i will come uh, feature them in future videos i hope that is valuable to you 
Don't forget to check out the free training. You'll see the link in the description below. My name is Richard Darby. This is School of Nomads. Until next time, take care.